morning, or yeah, it's not really morning anymore, it's like one in the afternoon. Um, I've been having a really, really shitty morning actually, to be honest. Uh, we were supposed to drive up early to Ore Bike Park or Ore Bike Festival to ride bikes and uh, be in the festival as early as possible today. But I was actually waiting for my bikes because um, I'm missing two frames that I'm supposed to use up there at the festival. But as I said, I've been trying to track the shipments for hours and uh, then when I'm actually getting hold of a person that knows what's up, they told me that the frames are stuck in customs. So uh, that kind of screwed me over because that means that I don't have any downhill or enduro bikes for a downhill festival, which is like not ideal. We uh, tried to make, make the best out of it and call the, a bike park here in Sweden that actually sells or rents out NS bikes. So, and they were kind enough to let me uh, just drive by and uh, pick one up. So I have one for the festival. Uh, all of this. Then we have two more bikes, my hardtail and uh, some other stuff. So yeah, we're gonna go and play Tetris in the car. And then as soon as we get into the car, we're gonna pin it up to Jerry's bike park and pick my bike up. By the way, I forgot that this guy's filming me for the weekend What's and this up? guy will also film and shoot photos and hang around. I got yeah. my two favorite people with me. I just realized that we haven't even put on the roof racks yet. A couple of road trip essentials. So it's like three o'clock right now. We said that we were leaving an hour ago and uh, I live 200 meters that way. We didn't make it that far, but I promise now that we're gonna cut to some road trip B-roll. We made it to Jersa. And this is where we're gonna pick up my bike. So yeah, this is the bike. Huge thanks to Jersa Bike Park for letting me borrow this one for the weekend. Such a lifesaver, because otherwise I would be without a downhill bike so yeah just gonna tune it up a little bit and then uh, it's good to go yeah let's get it on the road again so so far behind schedule as always put the uh, on the mattan as we say in Sweden floor the shit out of it <laughs> So I let Andreas drive for 10, 15 minutes maybe. And uh, now he's currently back in a police car. Because <laughs> he was driving a bit too fast maybe and a bit reckless. So I'm guessing that he'll get a big fat ticket and hopefully they won't steal his driver license. Helvete, bra med körkortet. Nej. Jo, det måste köra. Åh jävlar! Är du sant? Nej, jag vände. Jag fick en böter på 5 och 5. Åh oh, satan! Oh, it turns out that <laughs> he's not only getting a ticket, they took his driver license as well. So he lost his driver license. We have like 60k left out of 600 today. And this happens. And earlier today, my camera was laying on the roof. And then we drove away with the car and uh, it fell on the ground and then another car or our car, we don't remember, uh, demolished the camera. So yeah, my camera is completely exploded as well. So where did it come from? Because it's there a camera on the way. Jävlar!
Helvete. Yeah, it's a good start for a bike festival, but I'm sure that it's gonna be better when we actually get there. <laughs> Dead. I want to go to sleep. Today's oh, conclusion is that life sucks sometimes and it kicks you right in the nuts. Oh. <laughs> but yes, yes. you just uh, have to suck it up and deal with it. Sometimes mm -hmm. you break expensive lenses, microphones, cameras, or you get a ticket and <coughs> get your driver license taken away from you. But it's all good because look at this. That's life. We're in like the most beautiful place ever and we have a full week of bike riding ahead of us and other fun activities. So what we're gonna do now is that we're gonna take the bikes up into the room and get all our shit in there and go to bed and wake up early tomorrow to do fun stuff. Yes. Catch you in the morning. No. See ya. Fun.